Hey, what's up, YouTube, and welcome back to another episode of Colton School Legos, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build Savitar from CW's The Flash. Now, I know uh, the Beast Brick has done one that uses the same head, um, but I'm going to build one that I think is better than his, because... Because I think it's better than his. So, all I'm saying is I'm giving him the praise for coming up with the idea of what head to use. The reason I also think this head looks good is because Savitar has that, uh, like a, almost like a diagonal, right? Diagonal. Yeah, diagonal design going across his mask to the... Uh, to almost making a point at the front. And uh, this mask also has that ability. Um, so that is the head. Black Panther's head from the I don't know, $20 set with the rhino. Uh, moving down, the torso is from a Vermilion Warrior, which I got mine from the uh, cheapest Hands of Time set. I think it's the cheapest, at least. It has Kai and two Vermilion Warriors and then a Vermilion Egg or something like that. It's a pretty cool set. Um, and then the arms are from Nia from uh, the Lego Ninjago movie. Uh, both those arms. The reason I picked these is because they're gunmetal gray and um, they have printing on them. So I like how it did that. And then he has just normal dark gray hands. And then, I don't know if I'd really count this as a purist purist. It's pretty purist. There's just a few things. Like, on the Vermilion Warrior, um, you know, uh, chest plate, um, I put a silver stud on there, but then drew a lightning bolt. I mean, it's just a, stil a, st a silver stud. You know, without any printing on it, just, or s stud on top. It's just a normal stud, so I just decided to, um, just draw on it, because I can. Uh, and the other part that would make it not completely purist, which I actually did this on my Spider-Man Homecoming um, custom also, is the handcuffs. Um, these are the handcuffs, just cut the chain off and put them as, like, um, like, bracelets, almost. Okay, this video is going really long, so I'm gonna just keep on going. Now, the torso that I used, somebody probably me or my neighbor, actually drew on this torso, and I don't know where it's from, but I like, I just like the detailing on it, you know, the printing on it, and I think it works well for Savitar, especially with the Vermilion Warrior, um, you know, chest plate covering it. And then moving down to the legs, um, the legs are actually, uh, war machines, from the Iron Man 3 sets. Um, I picked these because I like the... They're, they're dark gray, and I like the silver detailing on them. And then, you see, I actually built a... Um, like, an extension, because Savitar is taller than most minifigures. For instance, um... Ironically, let me put Flash next to... Oops, sorry, I'm in the light. Next to him. You see, he's a little bit taller than the Flash. Although, really, he's like twice his height in the in the movie. Or not movie, TV show. I don't really care. He's taller. That's, that's all that really matters. But how I built those... Um, 
I did the same on each. So, you could probably tell from just looking at it, but I have a dark gray 1x2. And then put a... A dark gray 1x1. One one, a transparent blue 1x1. One one, and then a dark gray cheese slope on top of that. Um, the reason I put a transparent blue one right there is because Savitar has blue lights all in his suit. And I had to, and there's not very much blue in this suit, so I had to put it somewhere. So, the last piece is this little, is this little dagger right here. Um, I just stuck it in his hand. It's meant to represent the, the, like, knife that comes out of his, uh, the top of his hand. Um, the D, spoiler alerts for anybody who, um, hasn't seen The Flash and is watching The Flash. That he kills Iris, or as we later know to be, Harrison Wells, HR 19, with. So, yeah. That is really all I have today for showing you guys how to build Savitar from CW's The Flash. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe, and comment down below what you think of this custom, and what customs you'd like to see me build. Uh, thanks for watching. Bye!